Hi, in this video I will talk about the data sources for econometric analysis. So mainly we can use the two types of data for econometric analysis. Uh, one is primary data that are collected by ourselves or our project or our team. And the second data that are already readily available for our use. While the primary data should be collected by ourselves, the secondary data can be taken from different sources. One of the source is uh, the household surveys from which we can get household level data. The household surveys are freely available in some countries while they have to be purchased in other countries with nominal fee. In case of Nepal, we can purchase the household level data from Central Bureau of Statistics. Home level data can be obtained from uh, different regulatory agencies as well as the firm level service. Uh, for example, the Department of Industry may have the data, firm level data of the country. And in case of Nepal, for instance, the central bank in Nepal publishes the bank level data each month. And there may be some specific firm level surveys that are available in the websites of government regulatory agencies and other government organizations. The aggregate label data or economy label data uh, are maintained by the government agencies like uh, Ministry of Finance, Planning Commission, uh, Central Bank, etc., as well as the international organizations like World Bank, IMF, and the educational institutions. Some of the sources of time series and panel data are the Bureau of Statistics in the country, Ministry of Finance database, Central Bank database, the World Bank database available at data.worldbank.org, the IMF database available at imf.org slash en slash data, the pain wall table database available at this link, the OECD database available at data.oecd.org the SARC finance database available at this link and there are many others thank you for watching this video and please subscribe to my channel to watch more videos on applied econometrics in the future